Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This is Mr. Action Man. Today we'll be playing some War Robots with a noose-ish setup. So, instead of the flamethrower setup on Skyros last time, we have the sonic weapon. And I didn't have Havoc, so I just used a Sinister Cryo. And we get Seraph's same. Instead of Hawk, we have Angler with Talon, Light, and two Sinister Rhymes. And then the um, Tiger Scatter from Scorpion went to the Skyros and the Cruel Claw put, was put on Scorpion. So, Titan setup the same, and here we go into Beacon Rush. So, okay, spawn on the Skyros, and here I'm just going to go into Ball Mode and go to that nearest Beacon. Or not nearest, but the one straight in front of me. And here we get a beacon. It's waiting to capture it. And now that we do, we kind of go backwards. Go up this ramp. Now we're ready to fight for that middle beacon. So, oh, there's a Seraph there. Oh, there's a Cossack. Who even plays those anymore? Okay, so these sonic weapons are just destroying the Cossack. And now he's on like 2 HP. And thanks to Glitch, he's still alive. So I see this Seraph going up, so I just stay in ball mode. That seems like a short flight. It seems like we ended early. So here, I'm pop out. What? Wait, rockets can't go through there? Oh, retreat, retreat. Okay, so we're going to have to go in ball mode. See, we're getting leeched here, so... Definitely don't want to be shooting that leech. See, we got a demeanor. Doesn't really do much, because he has the tumble us. So just get some good damage on him. Now he's about 50 HP, or 50%. And so... I think... Once the Seraph lands... Okay, he uses his ability. And here, I'm just kind of hitting him with the sonic weapons. So his abilities kind of does nothing. And so... The Seraph flies up again. And here... I'm getting followed by the demeanor. And we're just finishing him off here. And then we retreat because that Fafner is doing some decent depth. De some decent damage with his weapon. Oh, that's a... Um, Fenrir right there. I think it's a cryptic Fenrir. Um, okay, run away from that battleship. Or rather, roll away. And here... Oh, the Fenrir's come down. And he has the whiteout drone, so now we kind of just should have let our shield fully regen, so we just got hammered by him. So here we're going to bring out the Titan, and we are just going to take out this spot here with the vacuum cleaners, get the kill, get some damage there. He's getting, that invader's getting hit hard. Okay, and then I misplaced my Orion, because there's, I meant to place it on that kid right there, because it has the extra Titan damage, and that invader just jumped away from it anyways. So here I fly up, with full clips and the vacuum cleaners, where we restored our health to full, and we took out about 50% of the kid's health, now we, here's the one-two punch. We load up our Orion when we unload that clip. And then once he, once we're fall down, falling down, we hit him with the Orion. And then it has gravity amp. So he can't run away from it faster. Or he, it slows him down so he eats more damage. 
So here we fly up again. And we are just healing ourselves while killing other people. And there's a Bayou Luchador right there. So we're just running. We're just kind of walking towards the battle. So we can get in some action. So it looks like that Luchador just jumped off the ship. So we got a uh, Ao Ming right there. And so we EMP him so he can't heal. And we just start healing ourselves and, and him. So I shouldn't have gotten off that. Okay, so hit him with the Orion. I think we're doing a little bit of, a little tidbit of damage to that Natasha. Okay, he goes up, so I decide, okay, let's finish him off. And we're getting hit by some Bayou Blistas. So we fly up, hit him, and we kill him. Now there's barely any people left. There's two people alive on the team left. And we're capturing all their beacons. guy goes up with his Fafner. And here we just... I found out that I was stuck and I couldn't move my Titan anymore. And so here while I was in the air I can move my Titan. But then watch this. As soon as I hit the ground I'm trying to move but I guess I just can't so... I mean, we're on really low HP, but, so that's that game, victory, and here we go, loading in, get a ton of rewards, get that, get those rewards, and here we're hopping back into another game, Beacon Rush. And here we go, I decided to go with the Behemoth Sniper, because this is obviously a sniper map. And here I go, walking over to an open area where I can start sniping people. Walking. So I decide, I'm going to take down this Siren, or Harpy, I think it's Siren, whichever one it is. But then I realize... I'm getting hit hard by an Airbus here. And I just... He must have maxed out lasers, so I guess I just died. And so my Titan's not really charged. I pull up my Angler. Because I see my teammate here is having some trouble. And I think he's an Ardent Blitz, and sadly he just dies there. And so I see that Seraph going up. As soon as he starts... Hitting me with his Electra thing. I'll go into my phase shift ability. And I'll run over to him. Do some good damage. And then just unload all my clips on him. That Talon's doing a lot of damage. So is the Bright. So we just take him out. Someone else steals the kill. And there's a Alkin. Which I'm starting to see a lot more. But they're like. Real beginner robots, only four light weapons, and they're like super low health. So here I'm trying to get them with the um Talon, but didn't go for cover. So again, the Seraph goes up. I go. In, there's two Seraphs actually. Go into my face of ability. It come out. He has two Termokels, so he's just loading out whatever he can on me. I kill him after that, or I don't kill him, I get the kill stolen from that Mars up there. And so I try to Orion him. And so I get blindness effect on him. 
once my ability runs out. So I'm trying to stay under him. And you'll watch. Here he falls. And then I'll just finish him off. Then here, since I'm getting hit from behind. Or, or that's my enemy. Or that's my friend. I just went into the face shift ability because I was panicking. And so, conveniently, right as I pop up here and start shooting at him, he... Both of them activate their purple shields. So, here I'm just going right here. When he lands, I'm just tearing him limb from limb. Of course, again, I get the kill stolen. Or the Mars bot steals kill. That kill wasn't stolen, but... That Mars is just walking around. And then I get some of his battleship. I get some healing and some shields. So here I see that Seraph, and I'm like, I think I can take him out. Because I got, you know, I got two shields. I got, and then I see the Erebus there. And this guy, let me tell you, oh, he just wasted his his home and EMP thing. Oh, I'm getting hit hard by that Alming. So he was just kind of walking away in fear. So here I take out the mirror mitts, and I can see that Ardent Behemoth just died, but he had four Stellar Prismas. And so that Erebus next to Seraph on 1 HP, I go into this cover so he can't hit me. Because obviously, when I'm getting hit by him, those are pretty maxed out lasers, and they do a lot of damage, so, I can, but I can heal that up with my weapon, so here I'm just trying to get closer and closer without activating my ability, because in my ability, I am extremely slow, and I'm kind of just, like, I can move a little bit, but not really that much, so I EMP him so he can't heal, and he starts being blinded. And from my one of my friends, and he's kind of just getting ground. I realize I'm getting hit pretty hard by this Erebus. So I hit him with the EMP so he can't do his ability. And here, apparently that Alming didn't die. So I'm going to take the opportunity to finish him off here. Heal up some of that health that Erebus destroyed and then here we rip apart the Erebus with our battleship I mean look at that full kill and then the Luchador kind of spawns into that so we get a ton of free damage while he's like kind of Wi-Fi is going hockey and our battleship is going up at an alarming rate not really alarming a good rate fast so that Luchador dies. And here, I'm just waiting for the enemies to spawn another Titan so I can destroy it, which I see in um, Aljun, which is the flamethrower guy. And I guess he just realizes he can't really get me and so I'm just get all the beacons and then there goes victory so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to like comment subscribe and hit that notification bell be sure